Doing our coverage of this snowfall if you're heading out the door this morning for some weekend plans. Now it's not the road conditions you're going to have to worry about. Earlier this morning, the visibility was a big issue. 11 News reporter Brian Sherrod joins us live from outside our 11 News studio this morning. And Brian, you actually drove here from Larkspur. How were the roads? Kasha, on my way for here from Larkspur, the roads were not great. It felt like when I was in that backcountry area, the roads were still covered with lots of snow. And then once I got to I-25, I thought it'd be a little better, but the visibility was not great, especially when you go to the Woodman area. It felt like you could not see much far in front of you. Now, I will say that it is a lot better being out here outside of the studio, being here on East Colorado. The roads actually look a lot better, so we are seeing at least a better improvement when it comes to the roads. Now, if you look around me in our parking lot, there is snow everywhere still not as bad as it was earlier when I first was driving here. It felt like I couldn't even see where I was supposed to park just because of all the snow covering the different parking spots. Now I'm going to still say the visibility just make sure you're taking the extra time when you're doing your commute this morning, especially on I-25. Like you mentioned, if you're going to Denver or going to Pueblo, you just want to make sure that you're taking the extra time because if you can't see that far in front of you, you don't want to cause any type of accidents. Now I will say so far it has been good. I haven't heard any crashes or any accidents this morning, but I'll of course to keep you updated as we learn more. Kosh, I'm going to toss it back to you. Sounds good, Brian. Glad to see the sun is out in your live shot. Thank you so much. And